All right guys, welcome back. So in this video, we're gonna learn how to merge audio clips with video clips. So say for instance, like in this video right here, um, I do a home video and I take the audio, I'm sorry, I take the video from this, here I just made a video on it right now. I take the video from this, but I take the audio from this little lav mic right here. So by default, um, this video is gonna record the audio through my built-in microphone on my iMac, which is not ideal, especially if you're making YouTube videos like this. Here's how it sounds. Let me kill this and let me turn this up. That'll work. So here's my audio without my lav mic, without my external microphone that I'm using. Get the clap, dude. Okay, so in this instance, I have the video on and the audio on. Obviously the video is going on, but the audio is getting sourced through my built-in mic on my computer. On That's what I just said. My Mac. But I'm gonna be going with this audio right here. I have a lav mic connected to a Zoom one right there. If you guys want a tutorial on that, let me know. And we're gonna go ahead and- Sounds like crap. Um, doesn't sound good at all. Now let's go ahead and sync this up. So I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna zoom in. And where's my two claps? I've got, let's bring this back up to zero decibels. Just like that, I'm going to, whoa, where are we going? Two decibels, zero decibels. I'm gonna ripple trim all this intro, all this dead weight, we don't need that. We've got snap on, and I'm gonna kill this. Now this should sound much better. I'll just go forward a little bit. It's timed up, you can see right here where it bottoms out, or it tops out, where it gets over, what is that, like, 12 decibels, that's where the clap was. Let's go back down to one for this and bring this down to zero. Let's give this zero value, null value. So now let's hear it. Okay, so in this instance, I have the video on and the audio on. Obviously the video is going on, but the audio is getting sourced through my built-in mic on my computer, on my Mac. But I'm gonna be going with this audio right here. I much better, right? So what, do I want, what I wanna do now is I can clean this up a little bit. It's timed up perfectly. And what I'm gonna to wanna to do is I'm going to want to pretty much just overlap this audio since it's within a couple, probably within a frame or two of this. So even if it's a frame or two off, no one would ever know. And editors do that all the time. It's not the exact same frame where the audio is overlapping the video. Uh, so the mouth can move a couple frames forward or backwards and no one would ever tell. So that's what I want to do, but I don't want to have two audio clips. I don't want to have two clips for this. I want to have one clip. I want to combine both of these. So what I do is I click on this and then I'm going to hold shift on the keyboard, click on that. We're going to right click and we're going to do new compound clip just like that. And it's going to give it a name and we'll call it audio test two, something like that. And that's it. So it's synced it up together and it's using the audio now from the lav mic and it's not using the audio from the built in. So in this instance, I have. So when we control this now, this is the settings from the lav mic and there's no more built in audio anymore. The video on and the audio on. Obviously the video is going on. God, my room's messy. I took this like two minutes ago. All right, guys, this video kind of dragged on a little bit longer. I like keeping all my videos under three minutes. Let me know if you guys have any questions. Let me know if you think my room's a shithole. Uh, I love the questions. I love the comments. I love getting back to you guys. I'll see you in the next video.